Yeah, so we'll start recording now. Um, this is uh, September 18th, 2023. And the uh, group is uh, meeting um, uh, with Efim Chorni and um, it's uh, on board right now. We have Ethel Rehm, Michael Alpert, Josh Wolewski, Itzik Gottesman, uh, and myself, Mark Slobin. Um, so uh, Zev Feldman is unable to attend today. Um, so we're delighted to, to have you with us. We all think very highly of your work and your contribution to keeping Yiddish song alive and well, in, in, uh, particularly in your part of the world, which is where it came from. Um, so um, yeah, why don't you just start with some ideas and, and we'll see. Thank you so much for invitation. It's for me a big honor to be here in, in this conversation. And I, I want to, to tell you that I had a, 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 a talking with one man. He lives now in Moldova. He did research in Moldovan songs, uh, folk songs, and he traveled a lot. And I asked him how you, how you talk to the people, how you ask them to, to, to present the folk song, songs, because he collected like a few hundred Moldovan folk songs in the different areas of Moldova. And he said, it's very important to, to explain the, the person to whom you are talking, uh, what, what you want from him, because sometimes he is thinking, this person is thinking that it's, it's for, it's kind of performing, it's kind of, it's kind of um, presentation of, of the song. And, and it's very important to, to prepare uh, this person. Sometimes when I was listening, uh, the this conversation between the the person who is asking to sing to sing a song and the person whom he asked, it was not. I think it was not too very professional, uh, um, and I cannot explain why. But but for me there are. Let's say I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. There are three ways for presentation of Yiddish folk song. One, it's kind of utopy, kind of, uh, but not. Uh, uh, you, you are singing, let's say, a lullaby for your child and nobody sees it. I think this is the best way to present uh, because you are not presenting a song, you are you are sculpting in time, let's say, and this is for me very important. For example, for, for example, the simplest, Shlo, 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 der Tate wird von ihm dort, wird er bringen an Isele, wird sein Jesu, dein Fischele. For, I, it's for me, this means that the, this mom, this father, they are singing for the this child, Yankale or Rifkale or I don't know whom. Yeah, and this is the the best way of of uh, presentation. Another way is that you know that you are singing for the for the recording, and you do kind of theater, kind of kind of like presentation. And the third way is the way of on the stage, because you have to show your talent, you have to, to present, you have to, to see that who is the last line of the venue and so on, so on. For me, the best, the main, the best, the, the good way is first one. It's mm -hmm. for beginning for like making this appetizer. I don't know if I explained uh, well what I mean. Sure. Uh, sure. Maybe you can ask me questions. Sure, I, I, I already love any question from you. Let's go. What was the word you used for number one, Fima? Sorry again. What was the word that you used for the first uh, occasion? It's, it's uh. a word I'm singing for yourself. Nobody hear me. 
let's say it's a utopy it's impossible mm -hmm. but it's possible to imagine nobody hear me i'm singing for myself uh, this 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 melody this melody sometimes sometimes i'm doing for myself susan is somewhere at the work at the job and the kids are somewhere and i'm singing to myself and maybe i imagine that somebody is recording me this is the way the best way if it's possible to imagine this way this is the way how i imagine can be the best way for recording uh, the the folk song when you say utopia do you mean uh utopia like what utopia. we would say utopia in english utopia, yeah that's what yes. i thought yeah yeah, great. yeah. but it's great. Not. beautiful but beautiful it's not. but it's not right. because i think you can make a a design you can make a picture of this utopia you can you can try accept <laughs> everything and to to stay only yourself not to think for how great i am or i am here listen i am singing for you it will be forever this song it's it's kind of like like tish tish singing around the the table in a choir and you are part of this choir this is my my understanding how it should be um fina can, can you elaborate on some of the other occasions like singing a lullaby um that that um that occur in in your life or in the lives of uh, people that you teach songs to you i'm thinking to... yeah yeah you want give me to some sing other a lullaby you want me no 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 uh, well uh, of course, but um, actually the lullaby you sang is one that I sang to my kids as well. Um, and uh, well, I mean, just just to say what what is uh, wonderful about that song is it's very open-ended. Uh, we used to touch the part of the body that was mentioned <laughs> as the verse came up. And of course, make make up um, other verses for other parts of the body and and uh, etc. It's very interactive, and also part of daily routine. Um, so it gives it gives a an intimacy to the to the song that's being used, not not simply performed. Um, so. Uh, I, I wonder, I mean, I think of other occasions like riding in a car where uh, one sings uh, other, other, other occasions that, that you can think of, you know, that occur for you or for people that you know. Uh -huh. So uh, let me, let me try to, 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 to sing a song, and after we can discuss about this, I don't know which. Could I just ask you if you can turn up your volume a little bit? Yeah, actually, while we're at it, can, is it possible you can either move closer to the camera or or bring it closer to you? So because you have such a wonderful face and an interesting face, and oh, and this is this is most I, this is most possible psychologically for me oh okay yeah, yeah, yeah. okay so, yeah yeah sorry or even face it a little bit down um if if that's best for you then do that yeah good great thanks um, one second <clears throat> here uh this is better the sound is better yeah, yeah, yeah even, a little, even a little more would be nice yeah, yeah. It's this is the 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 highest. Oh, okay. Biggest. Okay. Slow monkey, farmer the way, dunkler than the 
You know, I was thinking from the point of view of analysis that we're focusing on, you raise a really interesting question um, because to analyze uh, a song in front of you without knowing the context of the singing uh, is is kind of limiting. Um, if it's sung for intimacy, it's you would really want to think about it one way. Um, if it's being sung for recording or if it's being sung uh, for, uh, for an audience. Um, um, it, it does affect the parameters, the, the actual things that we look at when we're trying to understand the song kind of in a more analytical framework. So um, I'm not sure we always take that into account. Um, like we work off those archival recordings a lot, but um, do we think enough about the fact that they are recordings, that they were solicited, elicited from, from people in terms of understanding the performance practice that um, it's very hard to get, of course, recordings of people doing things just for themselves. Um, um, that's kind of something you can't really do without surveillance of some kind that we don't tend to want to do. Um, so uh, I don't know, I'm just throwing that in there because I, I think you're raising an interesting point. Uh, Die Lied, was das jetzt gesungen, das ist dein Lied, ja? Nein, nein, das ist nicht mein Lied. Das ist ein Lied von ihr Gedächtniswert und geschrieben, aber das ist, a, das ist a, kein Erfolglied. Das ist, weil ich äh, gesungen das Lied. Das Lied ist von, von, drei, von äh, 30. Jahren, it's for 30s, 40s, and, and here is this, this Hodler, its meaning of Stalin. It is the, the yeah yeah sure it's it's about uh -huh. this they compare this this eagle with with Stalin and this is mm -hmm. very important point in in this song yeah who do you know this song from how do you know this song I know it from Russ Rubin archive it's very simple ha 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 yeah <laughs> but it's composed it's I was thinking it's it's a fault it's composed there are there were a huge, you know, a, a, a lot of songs uh, about Stalin in the 30s, 50s. This is one of these uh, part of these songs. Hmm. Uh, Fima, when you say it's composed, how do you know that? Because, because I will explain you. This is my favorite question. So uh, I, we, hmm. we in uh, in these three years, not only in this. 10 last years, we transcribed and uh, and wrote with a music score 
more than thousand songs and we have music scores here and yeah, and we 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 are looking for inf for information when 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 we, we are looking for a song we are when we are st start to to learn to teach the song to the people we are looking from the different places and and uh, to bring to bring all the information and i found somewhere uh, that this song is composed of somebody i don't remember the authors so let me follow follow with another question if if you had come across this song and did not have the information whether it was composed or a folk song um how how would you in your own mind if you were to try to decide which it was what features would you look at the 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 text the music what features of the music text music a dialect uh and knowledge about period some knowledges because i have um we have a lot of different different songs of different periods and we try to compare when was it composed and how was it composed so different and we try to 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 explain to ourselves mostly the text and of course the mu music and text what else can be you well but but um which features of the music let's say would would tip you off that this was composed rather than a, a folk song ah uh, the because the folk song it has some some specific things in in itself i don't know how to to explain it how to how to well well take take the song that you just sang us yeah that that lullaby um is there is there anything about the the melody that feels more folk or more composed it feels like more folk but it was composed and if i did know that it was composed i i was thinking that it's folk because it looks like it's very interesting sometimes i also try to, you know, I I had a I had an um, an occasion. We we were traveling in the somewhere in Europe, and we came to Vilnius. We we were teaching many years in Vilnius University Yiddish song on on the courses of Yiddish. You know, now not exist anymore. And I sang my so this song. Migele migele kotenai oite pomeranzen koch mir sechs Kartoffel auf geir baldir tanzen. And one woman asked asked our friend, um, "What what is this song from? Uh, who com who uh, from from where?" And he said, "He is very famous person in the Yiddish culture." But he said, "You don't know. It's a folk song." And I was so happy because it's my song, and you know, <laughs> it's also it's also kind of kind of play, kind of play. It's it. I I was so proud that. That now with this, this is a folk song, so it's also kind of experience experience of mine, yeah. And and uh, I didn't know a few years that this is a, not a um, composed songs, uh, composed songs, but but uh, in a in a Stalin's time, a lot of composed songs became folk songs. I know this exactly. And I have some material about this. Yeah. Yeah. Well, yes, absolutely. Well, that's what <laughs> it's a wonderful experience to have mm -hmm. as a as a songwriter. Um, but we know Gibirtic songs, for example, uh and etc., et you know, and um Goldfaden uh, uh and, and on and on and on. And of course, folk songs also at one point had a beginning, so we may not know who first put them together musically or, or text, but they also have, um, you know, a point of origin. 
But I guess it's it's more a, a well, someone like Goldfaden was was a trained musician. Um, but I'm I'm just wondering in in the structure of the song itself, even the length of the melody, um, the complexity of it, the uh, extension of it. Uh, if you have thoughts about what distinguishes, say, a theater song from uh, from a folk song, or what we call a folk song, you mean even uh, if even if written by FEMA originally. You mean sorry, uh, Michael? Can you can you repeat, or maybe Michael will try to translate me what what uh, Josh said because I didn't understand some some. Uh, um, Josh, well, I mean, you can say it again in Yiddish. Yeah. I mean, I, yeah. Uh, or, or maybe Russian. I don't know. You're, no, you're Russian. No, Russian. I mean... I, I, uh, the forum for music. This is we will tell in us in us trophy. We long as we see such a a zusong, sinish the the formal aspect of a of a lead. Um, See, the host Gedanken was Fernando Scheta, folks lead for a lead with a compositor of them as well. You mean, may, may I try to translate from Yiddish to, to English or how to say? I mean, yeah. I mean you mean how, how to, what is the difference, how to understand the difference between the folk song and theater song, right? Am I right? Yeah, theater or other song with. Uh, a trained composer, a musically trained composer. Ah, oh, you know, uh, there are uh, different genres of either song. Uh, and I know these genres. I know genre of operetta. I know genre of chamber either song. I know genre of the song uh, for dancing song. And other others, and uh, and I when I hear the the folk song, it's a little bit it's different. It's it has some specific things. I I can't explain which, but it has. And yeah, what are what are for example in the song that you sang with uh, with the Odler, what are things that make it feel to you like a folk song? And what are some things that maybe uh, make it feel like it's not necessarily a folk song? Can you talk about some of those things? Folk song has, you know, there are there are uh, different uh, types of folk song, and when you know these types, you you put you say this this this. And you found the song, you take the song and you are singing. Mm, it's one of these styles. It can be lullaby or, or let's say dancing song or, or song of like Ganevim lead or something else, something else. And, and, and you, you try to put in in kind of frame. And if it fits to this frame, it's this it can be a folk song let's, let's look at this song specifically the, um are there certain are there images in the song in the in the text for example are there razne abrazi that uh seem to you folk are there things that stand out to you like the folk yeah the folk is odler is an image odler the wing is an image the 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 a, a difficult work of of the father is the image. Mm -hmm. The the rivers Biro Ibijan is the image. The time is the image too. The the and the uh, the lullaby the style is the image, and the melody is also the image. So different things are together and. Maybe it's a genius composer who did these images together. Um, if you if you compare that lullaby 
with Roshan Kismit Mantlan, which is originally theater song. Um, how would you compare them in the ways you just spoke of? Ah, uh, it's a good question. Uh, the, you know, first of all, I worry there is a refrain. Uh, the, there is a, there is a, it's a, it's a different music. It's a different uh, yeah. way, way of expression. Uh, uh, how how and, would you... And also, and yeah. also, yeah, yeah, say, say, what? Uh, no, no, how would, how would you, how, how are they different musically? This is a very interesting point for us. Ah, we have here a little, a little theatric moment in, in this, in this uh, Rojinkes, in this piece, little theatric moment. And the text is, uh, also give me some, gives me some some ideas that it's not false it's hard to explain i don't know never never try to compare it it's a i have to make a brain brain attack a brain <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah yeah but it's different of course yeah yeah hard to say uh, no, it's it's yeah. I I don't know. I don't know. It's I never was thinking about this. Yeah. Um, I have another kind of question. Um, so you're an uh, an expert uh, in the Moldavian Moldavian Moldovan Yiddish song, uh, and we um, we think uh, because of the work of Zev and other people. We're interested in Moldova usually from the instrumental uh, point of view because it's so influential, it's so important in, in, in the instrumental world, the, the Moldovan influence. Uh, but what about the song world? Um, what part of, um, in, in, is there a way in which songs from Moldova, Yiddish songs from Moldova are different than Yiddish songs from, from other places you know? Very simple, it's very simple. First of all, there are no many. There are very little, very little uh -huh. uh, amount of this Moldovan folk song, but but uh, one of the of the um, um, things is the dialect. It's a dialect. Another is the the uh, typical for uh, um, the 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 Moldovan moods, the Moldovan uh, uh, the it's mm. based on. On Moldovan on Moldovan melody, uh, for example, Trine oigen od der boim schwarze oigen od die Nacht, bloie oigen od der Himmel und der boim ich hoppe drimmen. Lili li 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 like this, yeah, <laughs> and um, yeah, and this is the, the difference. This is the difference. I mean. The, the Moldovan uh, mood, Moldovan scale, how to say, and uh, and also text uh, should be something in the text, uh, something green, something like a grape <laughs> should be. Yeah, that's yeah. It's a lot of songs like this, but we have no a lot such such a lot uh, such a, so many many Yiddish song Moldovan Yiddish song. Uh, in in the um, in the repertoire, Ukrainian yes, but Moldovan very very less, very small amount. I I think Yitzhak knows also this. I was going to ask you, did you have any models for singing growing up from your home from your parents? Oh. Yes, yes, three family. models, three models, three. The first model was my grandfather. I I don't remember him well, and I know that he was a cantor. I don't know where he studied this. And he composed a little bit. I have no idea what way he composing, 
and his singing was he preferred to sing either song translated into Russian. And after many years, I understood it. For example, one of the one of the known songs which he sang in Russian, either song Zibn Tehter, жил был один еврей, имел семь дочерей, и все те дочки как цветочки были ей же ей. Все стали подрастать, а те стал хлопотать. На пропитание воспитание надо всем им дать. This is a Yiddish song, you know, guys. Yeah, Zibn Tehter, and it's one one line. Second line was and is my mother. She was singing, still singing, Moldovan, Romanian, and Yiddish folk songs uh, at home. And um, after the war, he was singing on the stage also. And uh, I knew from her some popular songs as Saposhka Lech and and so on and so on. And the main source of of the third was my sister. At the end of 60s, beginning of 70s, we had a Yiddish folk theater here. 100 young men and women, girls and boys, were play, they played there. And I was like five years old uh, boy, and I also was singing there. And they were, performing and singing and let's say so-called Soviet chamber classical style of singing. It's very interesting part of the history of either songs. And they were composed in 60s and 70s. Many Yiddish songs special for the theater for Yiddish stage by, let's say, Kompanets, composer Terletsky, Emil Gorovets, and so on, so on. And I know many songs from this repertoire, and my sister still say, only this is Yiddish, not your folk, not your folk song, only this. And I am also mm. part, in, in my songs, I also used a part of this, of my biography and some of my songs also composed in a, such a style. This is three parts of my biography. And the fourth part is when the, when everything became possible and we could go and meet Adrian Cooper and Zalman Lotek and other great musicians, it's, another way the fourth way opened for me and yeah and now we are together and we are talking about this where were your for, i want to go back to your grandfather um what do you know about him being a cousin and where was where was that where was he from only he was born in a in a little village in, in near kishinev and he had eight seven brothers and one sister and and um, and i don't know when where he taught this hazonim i don't know and i know my mother said me that he was a husband he was invited to yash and he was a husband in kishinev and that's all what i know about him about how he did it and from time to time from time to time he took he took the 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 torah or prayer book of prayer and he sang something and that's what i know about him that's all what's the name of the village he was from uh the the former name was kobylka and mm -hmm. now it's kodrianka rayonal strashen it's mm -hmm. near kishinev near kishinev these my mother's part of family is from there yeah and my father's part of family is from Czechoslovakia from somewhere I don't know from where yeah but, ah. my, father, but my father was born in in Moldova in Kishinev too uh -huh. 
And then does Yeba, your sister still live in Brooklyn? My sister still live in Brooklyn, yeah. Uh -huh. And we are talking every day. Uh -huh. And my mother mm -hmm. also still live in Brooklyn. Right, right, right. Mm. Hmm. Uh, Fima, go for it, guys. When was when was the uh, the moment, if you can tell us, that you your your life turned towards music? When when I started to to yeah to, to feel that this is going to be your the major part of your life. Uh, music is not the major part of my life. Never was. The major part of my life is cooking in, in the kitchen. I'm not kidding. Because, you know, music st still now, it, it's not a, a play. Still now for me, it's a hobby. Because, because I don't feel myself a musician like it should be a musician. I don't know why. It's because my dream was to be a writer or an actor. And the music is the answer to, to why I'm not a, an actor and why I'm not a writer. It's kind of mixture in, in my life. And in, after this unsuccessful experience, let's say. But uh, if let's go to, to the real life, I, I was singing from my childhood and I, I was singing from five years, uh, when I was five years in Aida's theater and I'm singing all my life. In, in, it became, in general, it became my life. Yeah, it's, I don't know when I started to feel, I, I went to, my parents didn't know that I, I went to the music college and when the, the exams were successful, I called to my parents and say, so I am, I am in college, so I will be a student. And yeah, that's all and after, you know. And in 1992, I organized the, the, the group of, of Yiddish musicians and we started to play in Moldova, Ukraine, Russia, and after all over the world. And yeah, that, that was our way. I want to ask if um and if we could take one song of yours that you've written and let's say one that you feel is in a more folk style um could you talk about that and what are the different elements that go into it the images how you chose the music or felt the, the music fits and so forth pick pick one of your songs this this what I tried to prepare for today because I didn't know Good. exactly the topic, and I I made a, a little list of my songs, and I and I said to myself, mm, try to explain to yourself which song came from where, which song mm. came from where and from what, and for example, this song uh, came from the from the from from hospital. Yiddish dance and from klezmer tune like this it's more simple what can be and this is maybe why it's recorded on 15 or 20 cds for different people Das Teller lockt schon mit euch und zimmert das Bissele euch. Dem dosigen Kurs mit you, bu 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 bascher und Gott in you. Ay 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 Und Latkes mit Anei, und zu die schöne Fisch, Bascher und Sagas um Tisch. Doch schießele Borsch mit Greuch, doch stickele Eck mit Breuch, doch Teller rettig mit Salz, doch Teppele Kasche mit Schmalz. 
this is yes yeah, yeah. when oh. when go ahead i mean i, I have something i want to ask but go. so what when you uh, if i'm not mistaken the text is is kharats yeah? yeah or is that yeah, yeah right man. so what i'm since i you know you and i have heard a lot of the same khusadlah um what was it how did this come together for you did you did you did you were you attracted to the poem by Kharatz and then thought maybe I should put one of these melodies to it or make up make up something that sounds like one of these melodies? How did that work for you? How did this you come know, together you know, for that song? You know what happened? The uh, there are two more lines at the beginning, mm -hmm. and when I take sometimes the 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 poem, sometimes I I add something, sometimes I cut something, and here was. Das, da 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 da, das Stiegel, das bissele Speis, das something mit Reis. And after, it was not, not gram, not rhyme. It was something from nowhere. And <laughs> how how this I found this book. Boris Sandler gave me as a, a gift this book, and I started only in two thousand three or four to read Yiddish, and I was full full meet meet melodies from these festivals in Petersburg, Kiev, Moscow. And sometimes I was pregnant. I was pregnant with with some I couldn't I still now I don't dance. And I was pregnant with 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 dance to 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 bring a dance as as a song. And maybe this was the reason how it came to me. And tam 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 tam. It was so simple, so primitive, and I said, I said I have to to add some primitive melody. Da 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 da. You see three notes. Oh, mamma mia! It's kind of it's kind of primitive <laughs> painting, and I did it. I don't know. It came from somewhere from the from the helicopter. From I don't know. It's nobody knows how how he composing. It's from the from Himmel. From I don't know. It yeah. Hard to say. So the same. Tigale Migale Kote Nice also also uh Harat. Tigale Migale Kote Nai Reute Pomeranzen. Koch mir sechs Kartoffel Lob Geir Baldir tanzen. Koch mir ob Kartoffel sen tanz ich hoi di tischen. Ob getanz dem ersten Tanz, tanz ich dir auf Frischen. Tigale Migale, Tigale Migale, Tigale Migale, Tigale Migale. Ai dai, ai dai dai, ai dai 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 dai. I die, I die, die, I die, 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 die. I die, I die, die, I die, die, die. I die, I die, die, I die, 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 die. That's all. That's all. We can come, yeah, you know. And some others in the same style, or, or I have, or I have um, uh, the. If you ask me about my my biography, there are songs from another part of biography like like um uh my grandfather sang this song i don't know who is who composed it shankar kedavai vodke balibuste dreitzer marky ole kim thompson das reidele dreitzer bim bom bim bom tra la 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 tra la la bim bom bim bom tra la 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 oi di bobe kortlokschen und das Seide sieht hier. Do you know this piece, of course, right? You know this. And my, it is kind of, it's kind of, uh, it's, I imagine this translated songs from Yiddish to Russian. It's, it reminds me this. Zilbila Dinivri, and I, I, I wrote, Sotamol Givena Melach, Mita Mahalke in der Por. Era schwere Kreuen getrogen, sie getrogen Fremde, oh, ja, ba, ba, ja, ba, 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 ba, ba. For me, the song, I don't know if it's a topic of our talking, but because I am with you, so you have to listen. Ha, 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 not funny. Yeah, and... Uh, and uh, 
for me, every song should be kind of, kind of sujet, kind of picture of something, even it's in a style of, yeah, of um, folk song also, yeah. Is to come back to the Malki mit Melech, this is your song? Or no, no, I... it's, it's, of course it's Meir Charat. Aha, uh -huh, also, course, but the, yeah. the, and the melody is, is yours? It's my melody, I think uh -huh. so. I, I hope I didn't steal it from somebody. Yeah, yeah, I hope so, yeah. Soll sein Gesundheit gegangen wird. Oh, thank you. Das ist richtig, ja. No, Thomas hat hier noch Fragen. Ihr könnt fragen, ob ihr Thomas will ich kennen, will ich ihn lernen, für ihn Thomas nicht. Seid mir mal ich gut, ja. What do you, let me ask if, in between a song like Tzigale Migile and that type of melody and one like, um, uh, what do you hear as a difference between those kind of melodies? Do you can you say what one feels like and, and the other? Ah, uh, aha, aha. The you know, you know, one this for me, this my song has kind of kind of kind of let me german a bit german smell a little bit a little german smell german taste uh and it has kind of kind of ballad kind of ballad also and and also a big another sujet long long story uh it's not a folk story it's a story uh kind of the legend kind of kind of legend old very old legend and the shenkarke it's full of of folk and and it's a it's a real play it's a it's a it's a more lightful uh like this how to say it? yeah and i added two more verses in the shenkarke it became a little bit different yoshke oi yoshke was crossed is here the banner the bismamir nit herster the bismamir nit einer yoshke oi yoshke the was crossed is here the banner uh i forgot no more ah sorry yeah yeah well, it's not too surprising if it sounds German because it's a, it's a, it's, you know, Ach du lieber Augustine. Um, yeah, yeah, it is. It is. It is. Trank, it is. Trank, <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm, is this what I still in a Gesundheit? Yeah, maybe. Yeah. yeah. Do you hear, do you feel a difference between a difference in, well, mode or mood? Uh, or or both between say Tsigali Migila and the song like Saravandrika, um, which maybe you could sing a little bit of for people. But it's not mine. It's my lyrics only. It's not my melody. It's partly mine. Saravandrika, Drika, Drika, Saravandrika. It's a typical Moldovan uh, dance. It's a typical right. Moldovan dance. Tsigali Migila has. <laughs> It's it's Frankish, maybe somewhere. It's 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 a Yiddish, more Yiddish. Salamandrika, uh -huh. it's typical Moldovan. Salamandrika, drika, drika, salamandrika, drika, dai. Salamandrika, drika, drika, salamandrika, drika, dai. Hey, 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 hey. Have a drink the cafe and barrel as the barrel. And make a limon as a kick at the limon. Salamandrika, drika, drika, salamandrika, drika, dai. Salamandrika, drika, drika, salamandrika, drika, dai. This is my part. Oi, 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 oi. Ach, wie sie so nach wie wohl, lass sie geht sich schön in Moll. Ach, wie sie so nach wie wohl, lass sie geht sich schön in Moll. Saramandrika, dri, and so on. Yeah, it's a, it's a typical Moldovan dance in a, in a fast tempo, 
as Moldovan dances are. And uh, Sigala Migala has a very Yiddish sujet, very Yiddish like uh, story. Yeah, it's it's a main, it's a it's a good difference. But I added Yiddish words in uh, Sarah Mandrika. It became mm -hmm. more Yiddish, of course. You know. Yeah. Yeah. So. Yeah. No, Gadai, Liebe Menschen. <laughs> yeah, if, if you want, but I guess. I, 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 ha I have one more question. Sure. Um, <clears throat> when, when you're working with, uh, when you're teaching Yiddish songs, mm -hmm. either to a, a Thor or to a workshop, um, what do you. What's the value of the Yiddish part of the words and melody that that um, uh, you feel is important for the people that you're working with? So look, we the, the first we go we go to the text because text uh -huh. is connected with melody, and um, I I I explain to the people especially in the individual individual work that you should have a special accent a special special understanding how how to pronounce the the words to pronounce the the lyrics is very important and and uh, what else and um in and we are working at the at the phrasing, at the phrasing, and uh, and uh, I can teach you now if you want uh, either song, and to show yeah. you how it. Yeah. 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 I don't have. Wait a moment. I will try to find one. One second. I don't know which one. <clears throat> Dima? Yes? Dima, are there collections of your songs that have been published exclusively? Uh, it's, it's, your very, songs? It, it, it's very, you know, it's very home homemade collection of this. It should, maybe we will do that later i will we will publish collection of mine and susan's songs it will be later i hope we will do that but now um it's it's a real uh professional collection uh, not exist not exist uh, the sooner the better i know i know <laughs> <laughs> yeah so let's try uh mm, Let's try one. It's not my song. I it doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. You will see why. Yeah. In the Kroinis Fundi Feller Leib the Hind noch Kleine Städtel Leite. Wo der Weg ist noch der selber mit dem Weisel Leifen Blättel Seite. Doch, schlepp noch ein der Skrip von Achsen, von Achsen und sie liegt der Weg verwachsen, liegt es. Hof, 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 in sich rein es von dem Dreusten. That's all. It's one verse of one Romanian folk song. It's you are my pupil. It's very, it's very famous melody, and when you will listen interpretation of Romanian orchestra, it will be five times faster. This they play this. <laughs> I ya la 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 la. So, and we go to our 
Yeah, say. No, go on, go on. Go on. Oh, I was thinking you, yeah. We're just and, and doing we, go. we just went, we just went to the next note. <laughs> and we go, we go to the, we go to the song and I want you to pronounce the, the to repeat the melody after me. And I will sing you the melody again and try to repeat who will be the best pupil. Maybe I choose, I choose, I choose, I choose, maybe Josh. Okay, agree, agree. Yeah, go. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Did you know this melody before, Josh? No. no. Okay. If not, let's go from the beginning. I try to sing for you the first line. Savlanut. <laughs> They have a patient and I will do that. Listen, I will do it because you are a beginner. You never sang this song. You never sang at all and sang it all. I will do it slower and you will try to repeat the first line. Is it a topic of our conversation? Can it be a part of the topic of our? Yeah, it, I, I'm not asking. I am asking an answer to myself. I say yes. Ha, ha, ha. Let's go whiter. Listen. Oh, Do we need repetition once again or not? Can you repeat after me? Once again. Yeah, I can try. Try, please. No, no, but wait, wait, not all together. Only one person. Only Josh. Oh, really? After, after, oh. Mark, you can do it later. Oh, no, I thought you wanted us to sing it. Open. No, stay in line. Stay in line, uh, Josh, please. Yeah. <laughs> you can mute yourself and sing. Very nice. Very nice. But you know, very nice. But you know, when you are singing, when you put the, the words, you you it's very uh, bad syllable, ti da da da. Why? Because when you do ti da da da, you are like uh, the the your lips makes too many movements. Ti da da da, better ya da da da. The use the syllable ya da da da. Why? Because when we put the words, it will be easier mm -hmm. to pronounce the words. Listen, I will show you. Oh. We need this legato. We need this legato in this piece. Try. I'm sure you will do it. <laughs> Very nice, very nice. But you did r. Uh, we need something between. You know, you you yeah. You only started to sing. Don't worry. I will do from you the best singer. What I did with with some different. Please, please. You are only you only yeah. Please, uh, not r, but d. Yeah da 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 r r Yeah da da da. No, not d, not r, but. Better like now. Yo, don't pull the tongue too much to the sky yeah. of the mouth. Yeah. Okay. Great. Yeah. 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 Uh, very nice, very nice. Now imagine that this movement, like yeah, you know, oh, kind of dance. Like do it easier, do it easier. Mm. 
Never use in your singing your head. Why? Because head is you use only your stomach, your vaihale. Look, I will show you again. We will stop for one line. We you paid. My lesson is already paid. Don't worry. We will we will finish <laughs> soon. But if if uh, not enough time, we will. I will add one more hour for you for free. Listen, you only stomach vaihale. Yo, yo, ro, 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 diaphragm here, here, yo, ro, 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 diaphragm only. No head. Put your head in your hands. Go, go, go. No, I'm kidding. Very nice. It takes years. To do that, but for now it's great. Now I will add the the first line. Dort in the Chroines from the Felder lebt doch heint das kleine Städtel. I will sing it for you. Don't worry. Don't repeat the words. And I will show you how it works together with words. And the same I do with a lullaby. When I a, when, and we can meet again with you after, but now we walk at this song. Maybe it's not the easiest, but anyway, listen. Wait, wait, sorry, sorry. Dort in the Chroines von die Ferler lebt, doch ein das kleine Städtel lebt. One breathing, you have to, to, to take all the air on the world and do it for one breathing. It will be great. Look, look again. Dort. And breathing now after Dort. Dort. No, like very strange, but you know, try. Dort in the Chroines von die Felder lebt doch heint das kleine Städtel lebt es. Try. In the kleines von der Felder Leipzigheim, das kleine Städtel Leipzig. Once again, not bad. Once again, yeah. not bad. In the kleines von der Städtel von der Felder Leipzig. das kleine Städtel. Lebt doch heint das kleine Städtel. Ja, yeah, right. Very nice. I call it for my students shooting. We cannot shoot. It's a shooting. What you do? To, 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 to. No, what we do in a also in a phone song, what we do. The look, the 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 melody doesn't matter. Only the action is matter in the song. In the song, the mm -hmm. action is matter. The the words, the people will understand, and the action is the main part of the song. That's all. This is how how Ruth Rubin express expresses, but it's not from Ruth Rubin. It's it's Moldovan. Can you try again? Yeah, you know, it's not bad from beginning. It's wrong for now, but it's not bad because you have to have in your mind what you did with only with melody. Yo, yo, ro, 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 and now we we put the words. It's as easier as possible. You understand? Good. Mm -hmm. For first time is good. Stop. You are nervous. You are stressed a little bit. So we will continue later. If somebody else wants to, I can do that with another song. 
with another song. For example, it can be with Michael. Michael, let's do a short lesson with you, if you like. Does she sell a Bosch mit Kreuz? Do you want? Uh huh. I yeah. will sing for you. Wait, wait, I will show you. Let's imagine. Yeah. I will show you. Does she sell a Bosch mit Kreuz? 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 Do you know the words of this song? No? Yes, no. I've. Uh... I've please heard sing. it. I've heard them before. Yeah, please I actually, sing. and without ever hearing it before, I sang it on a, a large stage in New York City. But Great. yeah, so it, now it, only these four lines. Please do that, and we will talk more about this style. So the shisele borsch mit kreut. Yeah, the herring mit kreut. Herring mit kreut. The stellar rettich mit joich mit zals. The step of the cash in each mouth. It smells. Do do she sell a herring meat croy? Do she sell a borish meat croy? Do stickel a herring meat broy? Do steller a retach meat salz? Mit salz. Do step of the cash in each mouth. Which mouth? I mean, Shmuel, yeah. But, believe me, I, I I had to really work on this to remember all the words when I've sung it before. But I mean, not to get the zalts and the schmaltz mixed up. That's fine. But the, fine. No problem. This is not those a problem. Those be sali, those be, those she sali, borish mit kroid, those sti kale, herring mit broid. I teach my pupil, I said to him, it's like a dance. When you pull the, the first, when you start from out, out of beat, and you, you pull the first uh, beat, the first accent, like you pull the leg on the, on the floor. Those. Like the this is my way yeah, to of teaching yeah so and right this is really helpful and and uh and gives us a good sense of how you think about the songs and of course <clears throat> it, it goes it's very complementary to uh, Ethel's uh, way of teaching and and the te that we have already on the on the website uh, the lesson that that Ethel does. So this is very uh, I think very helpful and <clears throat> to have a companion uh, approach me, to songs. You know, for me, for me, I'm sorry. I I tell you, I'm a little bit stressed. For example, if you will, if you give me Ethel or Mark or Josh or somebody else, I'm sorry who you are here and I I can try to prepare maybe one real lesson how I do it with my individual uh, students and we can meet more if if you feel that it's it's good for you and I will teach not because you are like not not uh, educated persons I will I can also only sh show the method how I do it because it's horrible that not not me, but it's horrible that not exist a school of teaching, not exist in the world. I know school of teaching Moldovan songs, Russian songs, uh, even gypsy songs, but not exist in the world, no any festival. Festival, it's not a place for teaching. It's a place for making business in a good way, in a good way, mostly also. And it, for me, it's a place for, for pushing me forward. It's a place for meeting with friends. It's a place for make a business for future, but in in a in a 
three, four days, it's only pushing. It's only a signal, nothing else. Like Adrian Cooker gave me a signal and I still try to find, to look where is the signal, how, how it works, how she did this, how she hacked the universe, how she hacked the universe. Because every time when you go to the stage, I'm sorry, so such a, such a highway uh, words, you think to how, how to hack the universe. Not I am on the stage, but, but you send it, send it there to the people. Uh, like, like once I, once I sang for Ethel, Ethel, if you remember before the, this, this uh, memory evening of Ross Rubin, this beautiful, Grüne Blätter, Reute, Reusen, start noch dir, ich start. Und ich schein die Welt, die Größe, start noch dir, ich start. Sie ist der Himmel bläu und klor, ich bin verliebt in dir bis gor. Oh, Janne, 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 start noch dir, ich start. Sie ist der Himmel bläu und klor, ich bin verliebt in dir bis gor. Oh, Janne, 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 start noch dir, ich start. It's a beauty, isn't it? Von wann hat er sich die Lied? Ah, von my question. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I came, I came to, to Bucharest to a festival and one friend of mine, of mine, Sean, Williams, he put me a recording of of the uh, Romanian orchestra with with a Yiddish singer. It's a family uh, Rosen Rosenthal or no, maybe I'm wrong. It's a dynasty of singers. Mm -hmm. He sang it more puyule more. Mm. Uh, Romanian and Moshe Lamster, our friend from from Israel, poet. He translated this. He translated many songs for me, uh, which I sing with pleasure. And this is one of the songs which he translated. And it's became yes, thank you so much. It's became really a folk song. Yeah, and you know it's very it's good. I don't know maybe. We have to meet more and more. Not, maybe not with me, with somebody else. But I think it's maybe good to discuss uh, in details to take one song, folk song in details, and to discuss how different singers, which recordings we have, they they in, in their interpretation and understanding how it how it works for them. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, I think it can be a very good topic. But today, you know, between us, it's my first time in life when I, when I am here in a such a, sorry, great, between such a great musicians, and I am a little bit, maybe like, like nervous and stressed. But maybe on the on the fifth time, on the seventh time, like Josh with my teaching, also will be more prepared. <laughs> And we will we will meet again. So, Alavai, uh, Alavai, Vaitin, Alavai. I'm no, I'm kidding, Josh. You understand? <laughs> no, it's it's a, a very helpful um, way of uh, exposing the way you think about the the music. Very helpful for us, I think. I do. You know what I do? What I do? I. I imagine so. I'm really. I like to cook. It's my. It's now Susan is cooking something. But when when she, I I don't give her to do anything. Of course, she also cooking. But I I love to cook, and uh, and my cooking is very very strict. I take fish. I know now. I put this and now this and this and this and. Uh, and after what I do, I do experience, 
some experiments, I add this and this and this, mm -hmm. because the first part, it's a logical part, because music for me, mathematics, for me, music is very logic, very logic, I think, more than, because you have to know everything, you have to know each step of yourself, each step, and after you go and make an art, after, if the God and you gave you this possibility, you will, if not, you can be, oh, no, 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 no. You can be some, you know, famous. You can be famous. That's all. Cool. <laughs> yeah. So you think that uh, putting together a song is like uh, cooking? It's, it's like cooking. And you know what's important? The each cooker he knows the principle of cooking but each cooker has a little bit different recipe the there is a principle it's a real fish and don't make from fish chicken don't make but inside of this fish be careful, be in structure, but, but you have to explain how you create the, the steps for cooking, how to create. Yeah, and yeah, this is important also for me. Oof, yeah. What what can I add uh, else? To... Well, I think it's a very good uh, first start, and I think we learned a lot about you and uh, and your surroundings, you know, and your background, and uh, uh, and the way you think about songs, which is what we were trying to do. So it's, it's... if if I can be somehow useful, and I, I my idea I want to propose ha 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 I want to propose to open a school for real school, let's say for like Michael did in Petersburg. I remember it. I did we did present with you. you. You had a school, one week school in Petersburg somewhere in a village, if you remember. Yeah. And it should be a real mm -hmm. school like like school of Russian song once per week or twice per week during one year. It can be during one year for kids for for teenagers and so on so on because it, it sometimes i feel it's horrible world because everyone can record himself became a horrible world i don't listen it try not to listen but when i open this internet it's a real horrible world and i think we should we should to do something with that yeah. absolutely yeah. absolutely yeah. Well, we really appreciate the, the contribution you're making. Uh, Thank it's, you. It's my pleasure. You know, uh, it's maybe, so important. maybe next time when 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 if we will meet next time in in hundred years or in hundred days or in two hundred days or in a few years. So I will try to be more focused to maybe to one thing and and my big problem, of course, you feel it. I hope. I, I believe that you feel it. It's my English, unfortunately. It, it is. It, no, yeah, I know. But anyway, it is. And of course, maybe I will bring, maybe next time I will ask somebody to help me with translation. It will be easier, of course, because 60, 70% of stress is today is my English. So after, between us, I will go and drink a half a glass of red Moldovan wine if you are not against <laughs> only half a glass, only half. I, I, still, yeah. Yeah, I think you could have a whole glass. It's okay. <laughs> Cu noroc și cu sănătate. Mersi mult și bucurie în acrobatie. În acrobatie, da, vai. Well, thank you so much. We really Thank you, dear friends, and hope see yeah. you. Stay well and we'll see you soon. Agit Yontev, un agit Yontev. Amen. Amen. My mom, my mom. Susana. Agit Susana, Yefim. Yeah, Yekhvile Bergem. My mom has looked. 